Hi there, today I'm going to show you how to make a website using a program called Web Starts. Now normally to make a website it takes several pieces of a puzzle to come together. One of those pieces is your domain name, that's the web address that you use to find your site when you get online. Another piece is your server or your web hosting and then a third piece are your design tools and a lot of times that can be actual HTML code if you're doing coding yourself. Now normally you have to create that HTML code then you have to configure uh, what's called an FTP client to work with your web hosting and then you have to upload and download those files and then you have to configure that domain name that I mentioned earlier that web address all to point to that server. So that process can be very complicated normally. But I'm going to show you an awesome revolutionary new product that makes it easy for you to create a website called Web Starts. Now all you need to do is start out by signing up for an account. And for this example, I'm just going to quickly create A test account and you just put in your name and your email address along with your password that you want to use to get into that account and then you click sign up it's free now that's a great thing about web starts it's totally free now this next page that you see on it on the page here is the design selection page and what you want to do is scroll through here and find a design you like you can click this white uh, design here if you want to start from scratch or you can choose any of these I'm going to choose this one right here now the next thing you will want to do is choose that web address we talked about earlier now with a free account on web starts what you get is a what's called a subdomain so for this subdomain I'm going to call this uh, June 5th test but you can choose whatever you want and you can see there if it's available or not but if you really want to get a professional presence online and get kicked off on the right or started off on the right foot and get on Google go ahead and select this option and choose a domain name that ends in a dot com so um, again here June 5th test. so uh, I've chosen a subdomain just for this demonstration so I can create a free account so I'm going to click continue to go on Now I'm in what's called my dashboard. My dashboard is kind of my central control panel where I can see all the important account functions that Web Starts offers. So I want to click on edit my website because I want to actually jump right in and start editing the pages. And here you can see I have a featured apps panel and then I have my design toolbars and I have everything right here. Now as of this moment what's incredibly awesome is that my website is really online and it's already published all I have to do is click view site and I can see that at my subdomain or my web address there's my site so it's all online now all I want to do is I'm gonna go ahead and close that apps bar out and I'm gonna put my company name here so I'm going to say now that's great I've put my name in there. Over here I can put my phone number. I can put my email address and my other contact information. Now if I want to change any of the images on my page, that's no sweat. I just click insert image and I can upload anything from my computer or I can choose one of these images that's already uh, in my account. So for this example, I'm choosing this image and I'm actually going to click on the slideshow that's behind it and I'm going to click that little red X to delete it. Now I'm going to place that image where the old one was and notice as soon as I click save, bam, there's no uploading or downloading of files, there's no installing software on my computer. I can just see that instantly I've made and published a web page and that's what makes Web Starts truly revolutionary. You know, I'm going to come up here and I'm going to add a little text box and you can see that um, just type right in there I can change the font style there's tons of different features of web starts there's lots of different things that you can do to really make your website pop uh, and 
build a website that really sells. Now, when you're ready to really take your website to the next level, get it on the search engines and get what's called a top level domain name, go ahead and click on add domain right here and then you'll navigate away and uh, upgrade your account and you'll be able to add a domain name and then that will be set up instantly. So I'll be able to take it from uh, june5test.webstarts.com to whatever.com, whatever .com I choose. So it's really powerful. It's very easy to use. If you want to create a new page, you just go up here, you click new page. I can create a copy of that existing page. Say I want to make a page called Vision here. I just click on that. And now I'm on this, this page called Vision. You can see up here in the top left the page name. And I made an exact clone of that other page. It was so simple. Now I'm going to save that. And you can see that also that Vision was added to my navigation menu there. So that's how to make a website the easy way in just a few minutes using an awesome, powerful product called WebStarts. So don't forget to visit WebStarts.com to sign up and make a free account and get started today.